Try the sword.
Money well spent. Thank you. Thank you. What's your name? Robin Hood. No more. Wait, stop it. <laughs> Hello, little sister. Is that what I think it is? Maybe. You brought that animal back here? You'll lead them straight to us. It'll be fine. We'll leave it out the back. I need a new horse anyway. <sighs> Hurry up. We're running late. For what? To give away all our food? Why must we give away what little we have to those that we don't even know? It wasn't even ours in the first place. Yeah, but it's very hard to steal. Not everyone can do as they please, Robin. <sighs> if nobody else helps them, who shall? Certainly not our queen or the sheriff. Stop your whining. We'll be down at the camp soon. It's just down the valley. But I'm hungry now. Don't worry. They'll be prepping something nice for dinner. Think about what we can get from this beast when we turn him into the slavers tomorrow. Will Big John be getting fed tonight? Don't you think you've had enough? Taking the king's mead is why you were in here. Still thinking with your stuff. In the fighting pitch, you won't get fed unless you win. I'll win. Don't you worry about that. I think you're going to be Little John soon. <laughs> there you go, buddy. There you go. That's it. Oh, my that's God. All I have. It's cool, isn't it? What is it? It's called a trebuchet. It's a siege engine. There's hundreds of them around Sherwood Forest. They're all left over from the Great War. Guards! Guards! <clears throat> Robin, did you see that? That was barbaric. You have to do something. It's not our war, Lillian. You're just gonna let him go to his death? No. No, I'm gonna follow him. There must be a prison outpost near here. Probably just down the river flats. We'll have food, wine, maybe gold. Everything we need. I'm gonna go investigate. Wait here. Let me come with you. No, no, it's far too dangerous. Stay here. By the time you count to 100, I'll be back. I promise. Just wait here. I'll be back. Count to 100! <laughs> <laughs> Here we are, boys. Look what we got. Nice big beast to sell to the slavers tomorrow. Fetch a good price, won't you, beast? Let me out and we'll see. What have you got for us, boys? Boy, let us out of here. What was that? There you are. I was looking to catch your attention. Who are you? You've got a pretty face, you know? I could be of better service out of this cage than in it. What sort of service Ever seen up a lady's shirts, boys? Boys? Look what I found! 
Something's wrong. Ah, look what we have here. Gonna raise the bounty on my head. The Sheriff of Nottingham's men inflicted brutal and uncompromising rule upon the people. Hunting was outlawed, livestock was confiscated, and winter storms stopped. <laughs> It? Your penchant for Chinese guards is rather expensive. I like them. They don't talk back.
Sheriff. I summoned you here because we need more gold. I shall have to raise the taxes. No, no, no more taxes. People don't like taxes, it makes them unhappy. And I can't stand unhappy people. So miserable, moping around with long faces. No taxes? Excellent idea, Your Majesty. We shall fill the royal coffers by selling air. Oh, can we do that? Your Highness, I don't know why you put up with this impertinent sellsword. Because he's efficient. He gets things done. If he's so efficient, why are we always running out of money? <laughs> because you scroungers keep wasting all my money. <laughs> Looks like Mr. Efficiency needs to do his job and get us some gold. His skills lie elsewhere. Really? I would love to know where. <laughs> Kill him. With pleasure. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, Sheriff. Would you be so kind? With your majesty. <laughs> now, get me some more money. Cedric, my old friend, how are you? Hey, there he is! <laughs> I heard they almost caught you! Well, almost counts for nothing. Anyone that can outrun a platoon of royal guards is all right in my view. I think you've earned yourself a drink. I think I have two. Three pints of ale. No, two. You're not drinking? You're not drinking. I mean, when are you going to stop treating me like a child? When you're not a child? <sighs> you know what? Little baby cup for my little baby sister. Cheers. <laughs> That's disgusting. I'm going home. So you two call just later. She's gonna be trouble with that one. She sure is. Runs in the family though. <laughs> How can I help you? Well, you can help us in many ways, sweetheart. Tell me, do you know the penalty for hunting in the Royal Forest? I do, but I am no hunter. Well, we tracked a well-known thief to this location. <coughs> Where did he come from, then? You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Where's Robin Hood? I have no idea who you're talking about. Don't feign innocence with us, Missy. We know who you are. You and your thieving brother. Thieving? You're the only thief around here. Your taxes and hunting restrictions are bleeding the people dry and starving them to death. What you must understand, little girl, is that people like your brother are costly to deal with. Because of him, I've had to upgrade my guards. Do you know the cost to hire Asiatic mercenaries? Trust me when I say, when I catch him, he will hang. <laughs> you are hereby arrested for poaching in the royal forest and holding stolen goods, for which the penalty is death. Make sure she doesn't 
My brother will hear about this. I'm counting on it. Do what you want with her. This armor, would you? It's jammed. Again, we'll have to get you a new one. It's fine, thank you. And the weather is beautiful. Yes. Clouds are here. Wonderful celebration. It's a great idea. My lord! Oh, oh. My lords and ladies and good gentlefolk all! 
We do so heartily welcome you to the tournament arena for the Queen's Royal Chairs! <laughs> Introducing our first competitor, bearing the standard of crimson red, we call forth Sir Simon! Good luck to you. Now, my lords and ladies, now, now. For it is my time to introduce to you our most beloved, our favorite, our reigning champion, the one, the only, Sir Lancelot! Yes, I knew you'd do it. Do it. Yes. Do it. My lords and ladies, this shall be our final pass. Who's cheering on Sir Simon?
She was an innocent Cedric. The things they did to her. I left. She was an angel indeed. We all share your pain. Yeah, then why is nobody doing anything about it? What would you have us do, huh? Storm the castle with a pitchfork? Yeah, if that's what it takes. We're just poor villagers. This sheriff has an army of guards, knights, soldiers with weapons that we can hope to match. So we're just meant to take it. We're just meant to get stabbed and killed and raped and they're meant to just tax us within an inch of our lives. It's not what I'm saying. No, this is bullshit. Heads up. Sheriff's guards are heading this way. Word is they're looking for you. Hide. Looking for Robin of Locksley! You want to rob a locksmith? <laughs> oh. Silence! Any man, woman, or child harboring a fugitive will be severely punished. However, anyone with information leading him to us will be swiftly and generously rewarded. Huh? No takers? Well, if you do see him, you know where to find us. Move out. Simon, on your knees. On your knees. Finish him off. Lancelot, finish him off. Your Majesty, this is but a tournament. The rules of a tournament state that if you... Sheriff. <coughs> What is this? What is the meaning of this? Knight code clearly states that you shall not be punished for anything that you stop! No! No, 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 What are you doing? What are you doing? No, no, stop! No! <laughs> this is an outrage! I thought it was rather funny. Have you no honor? Animal. Guards! Take him away! Take In him the away. eyes of God! This is wrong! The people! No! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> no!
Kerlchen Login. Yeah. Uh, uh, I felt better, but I'll live. We can fix you a tonic. Uh, water would be great. Water? You know fish fornicate in it. If you need a refreshing beverage, there's mead in yonder barrel. Thank you. Meh. So why did you stop me? Do I need a reason? Perhaps it was just a moment of human kindness. <coughs> One man reaching out to another. We all know who you are, Merwin, what you are. And what might that be? A lecherous old goat, a scamster. Somebody that doesn't help anyone unless is well paid. Oh, that's a bit harsh. That's a bit generous. Well, you're right. And you're wrong. I shouldn't have expected a straight answer from you. Well, you're right if you think the sheriff is dangerous, capricious, malicious, very unpleasant and must be stopped. But you're wrong if you think you can do it by yourself. You heard the villagers. They don't want any part of this, Merlin. It's not to them you have to look, Robin. You have a gift, young man. An incredible skill with a bow. It's almost magical. Look to others who carry skills, who have integrity, who have that fire in the belly that you have. Then you'll be unstoppable. You heard the sheriff. He has an army. He has Lancelot by his side. Red-crested mercenaries work for him. Even if I could find these so-called allies that you speak of, they're not going to help. It simply wouldn't be enough. You do your part, Robin. I'll do mine. Hmm. That is an impressive trick. Clive. <coughs> there is one condition, however. still considering your loyalties my loyalties are to God and the people I've accepted my fate I'm ready to die 
Oh, we're not going to kill you. Your fate is much worse than death. <laughs> Move, dog! Move! By order of the Queen of Nottingham, you are now banished. Thank you for the armor. Get this shit out of here. Now! I know you. Yes, I freed you. Damn well nearly blew my head off. You're welcome. You're welcome, you say? Looking for a sellsword. Well, I don't own one. <laughs> Means hired muscle. When we take the castle, if you help us, you can have everything in the world food stores. All the food and wine that your heart desires. What say you? All the food and wine I desire, you say? I tell you what, one condition, as long as I'm never sober along this journey, I will join you. <laughs> you got yourself a deal. Well, lead the way then, boy. This is the place. Tell the sheriff I don't have his gold, just come back another time. We don't want gold. We told you all the men to get us weapons. Are you licensed? What license? I'm only warranted to sell weaponry to the Queen's Guard, and those sent directly by the Sheriff. Screw the Sheriff! Don't touch. There's not much of a selection in here, is there? Oh, it speaks. I speak. And I'll bring you a scrawny neck too if you don't help us out. <laughs> what sort of weapon is this? Oriental. Far superior to your English steel. And what is wrong with an English bow? Absolutely nothing. It's good for hunters. <sighs> and women. Do not touch anything. How much for the bow? 25 pieces. 25 pieces. <laughs> I hear you have some sort of problem with the sheriff. Some sort of debt. A few gambling debts. A trivial amount, a few hundred pieces of silver. Doesn't sound trivial to me. 
Well, the payment from you gentlemen should keep him and the collectors off my back for a few days. You do have the gold to pay, correct? What if I offered you something greater than gold? I'm quite certain you cannot. What if I was to tell you that we aim to kill the Sheriff of Nottingham? Then I would check to see what herbs you'd have been smoking. If we do, your debts will be cancelled. Listen, the Sheriff killed my sister. He's slowly starving the people of Nottingham. We need to do something. My comrades and I, we vowed to kill him. End this tyranny once and for all. These comrades? How many of you are there? Including you? Three. <laughs> the chances of succeeding are about a million to one. Why on earth would I join you? Why wouldn't you? In the name of the sheriff, open this door! Let us in! Three it is. Back door this way. Just following orders. That's all. It was fun. She's trying to get away. I mean, the sheriff told her what to do. I have to give her credit. I mean, I've never seen someone take that many wounds to the stomach and still survive that long. I mean, where was her brother? He was in hiding. It would have been us at the other end of that sword if we didn't recover that horse. Better her than us, especially after what you did to her. Oh, she's nice. <laughs> but you're an animal. <laughs> <sighs> well. All's well that ends well. Robin? I thought he's with you. <laughs> he was definitely not with me. And where have you been? What have you done? Nothing that they didn't deserve. And who are they? I felt the guards took my sister. You'll be a wanted man after tonight. No more than I already was. Well, why didn't you wait for us? Another drink, lads? I think it'd be wise if you leave the whole barrel. If I hadn't have... Uh, 
taken the horse. It's not your fault, Squire. No. Look, so. By order of the sheriff, I order you to lay down your weapons. Sorry, I can't stand you. By order of the sheriff, I demand you lay down your weapons. I think you're looking for other people. What's that? Robin the Boxley, you're wanted for murder. What? How did, who, who did you kill? Two of the sheriff's guards. That is disgraceful. Did you know about this? You told me he was a tap dancer. Enough! Lay down your weapons or we kill you all. Gentlemen. Let us settle this peacefully. We must buy you a drink and be on our way. Step aside, little boy. We want Oxley. Then I'm afraid you're going to have to go through me. <coughs> Agree? Did you know we could do that? Curse this weather. Ten to one I have a cold by the morning. Cold? When I was seven years old, we were trained as warriors who were sent into the wilderness with just the shirts on our back. Oh, please, the North's not that cold, you big girl. Are you insulting me? Of course not. I like girls. Get up, idiots! The boss out there, not here. Guys. The price on our heads will have gone up tenfold after tonight. Perhaps they'll encourage people to join the cause. Or they'll encourage every fool out there at the sword going for the bounties on our head. <laughs> what did I say that for? You jinxed them. I knew you were bad luck. Who goes there? We invited no one to dinner. And the food's all gone. I'm not here for your food. I saw what you did to the guards tonight. I've come to join you. <laughs> well, what are you gonna do? Wash our clothes? <laughs> Besides, we already have a girl. We have no use for your skills here. Really? 
The three of you are going to take down the Sheriff of Nottingham all by yourselves. What concern of yours is that? His guards killed my entire family. Well, we all have sad stories. What can you contribute? It's not that impressive. What else you've got? She's in. No, she's not in. You can't just bribe your way in. She is and she can. So shut up and eat up. So sit down and tell us your name. My name is Freda. And if by my sword and cunning we can overthrow the sheriff, we can restore the land yeah, to its yeah, bubble. Yeah. Enough of your fancy speeches. As long as you keep bringing food you're in, contributing more than these two jesters. So what now? The Sheriff will have every guard within 20 miles looking for us. Us? Yes, us. <laughs> You're telling me that if I can knock that mead off your head, you'll take my watch for tonight? You won't be hitting it off my head, boy. I don't want to hurt you. Oh, you won't be hurting me. I can tell you that right now. Come on. Oh my god, you gotta be joking! <laughs> Did he even hit me? I didn't see didn't anything. Didn't even feel a thing. G give me another. Another go? Take another ten. Shh! Can I concentrate? I didn't even <laughs> feel it. I didn't see it. One more. Let's see what you've got. Oh, you gotta be joking. My <laughs> god. You gotta be joking. What about you, Arrow Boy? You will have a go. If you want to volunteer your shift, I'll take that. Oh, we'll see about that. Are you sure you're up for it? Are you ready, are you? Born ready. <laughs> what about you, lass? A woman knows when to pick her battles. Yeah, she might break a nail. You know what? If you can take this from my head, I'll do your shift for a week. Oh, now there's a challenge, eh? Unless you're scared. Ooh. Oh, she's getting up. I'd put my money on the girl. Yeah, me too. That's a bad bet. I, I think the boy's gonna be going down, I think. I'll be fine. I don't think so. Yeah, you better warm up. Go on, lass. Don't want to pull you back. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <sighs> That's bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> now that's what we're gonna go to war with. <laughs> <laughs> no. Your Majesty, I can't raise taxes again. I am already the most hated man in the land. And that's my problem because? I may have a creative solution for you. Show me. A royal proclamation that will solve all our money problems by redistributing the wealth to where it rightfully belongs. Where do I sign? Here, Your Majesty. Hmm. <laughs> the Queen has just issued a royal proclamation naming me King and has tragically uh, taken her own life. But I we shall all mourn her loss. Is there a problem with this? 
No problem. Your Majesty. With the Sheriff, now King, seated firmly on the throne, any resistance by the suffering people was quickly and ruthlessly crushed. You thought you'd sneak a look, did no, you? No, I was up here already. I was sleeping. I've heard you snore. You weren't sleeping. Yes, I was. You weren't. You know, you could use a bath yourself. If you're offering. <laughs> you didn't see that, did you? No, but I heard it. <laughs> well, I promise you it was as graceful as it sounded. <laughs> it didn't sound graceful at all. Sure you know how to do this. You're not doing it right. I know how to bathe. Oh. <laughs> I'll have you know I'm one of the cleanest men in all of Nottingham. Oh, I don't believe that for a second. Oh yeah? I'll prove it to you. <sighs> there you go. I'm not ready for your tomfoolery. What the hell, Fredo? It's just a joke. Oh! Hello, uglies. This is quite a surprise. Bit of a turn up, to be sure, and quite unexpected. That we're back so soon? No, Robin. That you're back at all. Hmm. One beautiful girl. A freak, a weirdo, and a pet bear. If you were starting a circus, Robin, I would say you're making great progress. What does everyone think I'm his pet for? Did you hear of the attack on the sheriff's men? Yes, I heard a whole legion was wiped out by a band of warrior princes. Freda, Tuck, Little John, my warrior princes. And, uh, all of you, uh... sworn fealty to Robin. And we'll fight to the end to defeat the sheriff, or we'll die trying. Oh. I do hope you don't die. It would be such a waste. Enough. You said that if I brought in allies, you would assist us in killing the sheriff. Here they are. Will you honor that promise? Well? Mm, it would be my pleasure. <laughs>
get for 50 silver pieces if we turn him in. Quickly, call the guards! You can turn us in, collect a very hefty bounty, and the sheriff will crush what's left of you. What crimes have we really committed? Defending people just like you? How many of our family members have to die before we stand up and do what's right? How many of your own families are starving to death because you can no longer hunt on your own land? The same lands that your ancestors died defending over hundreds of years. All is not lost. We can defeat them together. There is still hope. I say we rise as free men and women. And we demand a change. Yeah! I say we rise and we take back what's ours. Who is with us? Yeah! Die. And nothing will change. Who amongst you speaks? It's Lancelot. The one and only. Honorable Knight of Knights. Undefeated. Once loved by all. And now nothing. Still loved by all. Still honorable in our eyes. Why don't you help them? Because it is futile. <laughs> Gates to the castle are too heavily guarded. Even if you did sneak your way past the guards, you will find yourselves in a labyrinth of corridors. The way I see it, unless you find yourselves a guide with another way into the castle, you're as good as dead. <laughs> of time he's just a washed up has been mm -hmm. mm -hmm. the sheriff will be strengthening the castle's defenses to show up his claim on the throne you have to act immediately reinforcements will be arriving from the orient by the new moon i ain't afraid of no orientals puny little chinaman don't underestimate their power friend they fight in ways you've never seen And what of this way into the castle? I will tell you what I know. But you have to take me with you. You need me. There's a weak point on the south wing, and I know where it is. All it needs is a little force. Maybe a lot. And why should we believe a drunk such as yourself? My word is all I have left. Quite full. I, I mean, these here. Th this is quite a fall, uh, not yours. Did I bruise your ego? No. Just needed to get away from it all. From me? No. Everything. You cheated anyway. You know what they say? All's fair in love and war. No, you said you weren't ready. What are we fighting for anyway?
about tonight. I'm worried. About? You. Oh, please. I'll be the one worrying about you. I can't afford to lose anyone else. Me either. Come on! We've got a car for the beach. Patched with mudstone. Lead straight into the corridors adjacent to the Queen's chambers. Lancelot, how is it that you came to know of this passage? Well, let's just say there was a time when I held the Queen's favor. I'm sure you have more than just a favor, you sly dog. <laughs> So we're going to blow this thing up? No, son. We're going to melt it. Be alongside us, Merlin. I'm afraid not. This is where I leave you. You see, Lancelot, I am a lover, not a fighter. I'll see you all back at home when this is all finished. Good luck. Godspeed. Do with her as you wish.
Great. decided to surrender and save us a lot of time into your heart, or a slow death, sliced and diced like a choice piece of meat. My wish is to cut out your filthy tongue. You can join me, be my chief archer, live in luxury in the castle instead of the forest. I'd rather die as you wish.
sheriff wants him alive for his public hanging tomorrow. Number four. He'll enjoy the company. Are you alive, friend? Yes, barely. That's a lot. How? Where are the others? I stayed to hold back the sheriff's guards while they escaped. <sighs> That's very brave of you. And honorable. This is all my fault. I should not have brought you here. It was my fault. You shouldn't have run off like that. So In a few hours, our last sunrise will peek through these bars. Where there is life, there is still hope. <laughs> hope left this godforsaken kingdom long ago. as you hoped, I'm guessing. Uh, hello, ugly. Listen, I told you, any arrangement, contractual business dealings we may have had are now off. Come now, as if you get to choose. I merely wanted to invite you to my coronation ball. I thought my own brother should be there. I have no brother. And since you betrayed everything we believed in, I want no part of you or your world. And so you actively assist the realm's enemies. Your enemies. Brother, think of what we could achieve with you by my side as my advisor. I'll admit my methods aren't always the most savory. Let's not nitpick. With the throne now in my hands, we could build a kingdom to rival that of Camelot. Centuries from now, people will say our names with revulsion, horror, regret. You always were a disappointment to the family. I am so going to miss these little family chats of ours.
לעצור את השרף. Where are you going? To get my armor back. Money Robin give you? Receiving <laughs> whore. Sergeant! Hello, shiny knight. You coward. I came here to protect the people. Innocent people like her from vermin like you. Ah, <laughs> oh, princess. Now I have two bitches.
There is hope. Just shut up! A great warrior. He was an honorable man.
people! People! My friends. For far too long, the powers that be have robbed us of our families, our loved ones, and our wealth. That era is now over. A new dawn stands before us. So many people have died for us to have this freedom. We would do well to remember their sacrifice. But this day, this day is a day of joy. This day is a day of victory. This day will give the wealth of this land back to you. This peace has been hard won. Keeping it will be even harder. We trust you, Robin. The people trust you. I may have been the man to lead us in rebellion, but not in peacetime. This position must go to a man of honor, a statesman, someone that we can all trust. Lancelot, you've proven yourself to be worthy. I hand this position to you. Robin, I don't know what to say. All those in favor say aye. 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 Then it is settled. You honor me, dear friends. I will not let you down. <laughs> Have we finished with all this talking then? It would seem so. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get sloshed. <laughs> to a new future. To, to a new future. And with the power vested in me, I now pronounce you man and wife. Hear me now, kiss the bride. <laughs>
surprised to see me. Wizards like me do not die unless they plan it. And this adventure has gone exactly to plan. The trick lies in not making people believe your magic, but rather making them believe that you are not. Long live the king. Ha 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 